This book is Notes from the Midnight Driver by Jordan Sonnenblick. And um, Jordan Sonnenblick, the author, is actually um, a teacher who wrote this book. Um, but this book is about Alex, who's 16, and his parents split up. His dad basically doesn't pay enough attention to him. And so one night his mom goes out and he decides that he's really sad, but he's going to get some of their attention. And so he drinks all of his dad's vodka and he steals the keys to his mom's car and he goes driving. Um, and the next thing he knows, he has crashed into um, someone's yard and smashed a gnome, <laughs> got the head off the gnome. And he's now in the police station and um, he has to wait for a hearing and the judge um tells him that he has to um, serve serve the community, do some community service, 100 hours of community service. His mom has a little something to do with that, and he ends up working in an assisted living home um, for one of the most grouchy people in the home. And um, he also has a best friend, and he also has a bully. His best friend is a girl, and the bully is just this ginormous boy. And um, he's trying to kind of sort his way through things and, um, not a very nice kid, but he has a really good sense of humor. Um, and so he has, is writing letters to the judge saying, you know, please get me out of this community service. This, this old guy is super crabby. I don't know what to do. And the judge writes back and says, sounds fitting. Um, you need to continue, kind of step it up, see if you can learn something and see if you can teach him something. Well, and as it progresses, we find out that Alex knows how to play the guitar, but he's not good. And he decides to try and do some things through music. So I found this to be a rather um, simple read, not hard language um, from the viewpoint of the boy, um, which is really helpful because you can kind of get in his head. And um, the language is kind of fun. And um, the relationships between Alex and his best friend and his parents um, and the old man in the, in the nursing home, um, things kind of take a, an interesting twist. There are things that you can predict, but there's a few things that you can't predict. And, um, that's what is kind of the delight when you're reading the story.